Hey guys, I'm Ouroboros. Let's play Persona 5 Royal. It is September 5th, and people are talking about how popular we've been lately. What's this fan site? Oh, they have new merch. We Let's have merch. Work, the fandom fan thieves are amazing. I mean, even the harshest TD TV commenters are praising them. A lot of celebrities are talking openly about the phantom thieves. Yeah, they fight for the people. Anyone opposes them is just behind the times. Just look at that Akechi kid. He's catching a ton of shit for what happened with Medjed. Justice can't exist so long as the Phantom Thieves do big talk from someone who can't even catch them. Even politicians are claiming the Phantom Thieves are dangerous. They're all full of hot air, though. The Phantom Thieves are totally trustworthy. Mm. Looks like people are coming around to us. I would agree. I mean, you take a look at that, that poll on the fan site that we see every day. We're pretty popular. Granted, I imagine only kids are looking at it, but eh, we're going to ignore that. Everyone knows about the cover-up. It's not really a big deal anymore. You know what is a big deal? My Gunabout rank going up. Gunabout the super real? That's the one with the gun-shaped controller, right? Everyone's talking about it. The multiplayer is so good. The arcade on Central Street has it, so does the one in Akihabara. You should give it a try sometime. I played against someone really good the other day. I couldn't land a single shot on them. I wonder if it's the cheater. I wonder why they put that there. Is it because we have a Mementos request? Is Atlas actually good at game design? Uh, I kind of miss when no one knew who we were. Yes, Atlas. Atlas is actually good at game design. Who would have thunk? Wow, so crazy. And I'm going to take one more look. And I, I remember there was a girl. It was like that crazy bully girl. Maybe we already saw her. Are you the one? Ah... Because, I, I don't know, after seeing that Mementos target just, like, out in the open talking, I'm now on the lookout for more of these, and I want to know if I can find more. And I guess, now that I think about it, I'd never go through that courtyard. Uh, that's Maruki. Is it over here? No? Maybe up a floor? I'm just... I, I don't know. Might as well experience this while I've got the chance. I... don't think it's here. Well, that's fine. Um, today, we do have a bit of a shorter day, so I'm not really worried about, I don't know, going too quickly through this day, if that makes sense. I'm not looking to rush things today. Uh, I wonder if there's anybody in this alleyway? No, all the shops are closed right now, of course. Uh, we are going to, it says save our game. I don't know if you can feel this. We're playing billiards today. Uh, we're playing billiards today, and... I don't think you can, like, fail billiards like you do with darts. But it always says to save your game, so that's what I'm going to do. So let's play some billiards. Level up our technical rank, and let's pay 800 yen. That's pretty cheap for, like, five people to go play billiards. At least I think it is. I don't know. Inflation's crazy now, man. It's like eight bucks, right? That's like the... What's it called? The exchange rate for yen to dollars. It's like... Uh, like 100 yen is around a dollar, I think. That sound when the ball scatter is so satisfying. I am absolutely doo-doo trash at billiards. And we need to make a difficult shot. Are we going to bounce it? That key, are you going for that shot? Hell yeah, we are. All thanks to the books we read. Perfect jump shot. What a show off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're, we're kind of a big deal, you know? You actually pulled off that shot. That's why you're our leader. Looks like your challenge brought everyone together. And technical rank three. We get extra knockdown rank and three pluses to technical damage. So you can see the next rank. If I can not burp into the microphone. You can see the next rank. We get a lot of extra damage and we will always knock down the enemy. So this is why you need to be leveling up your technical ranks. Being able to just knock down any enemy with a combination of like... Um, sleep plus any move or, or whatever or even just like the, the shotgun that we have that was so, so 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 helpful unbelievably helpful hey sorry to interrupt your fun looks like you're you're trying to learn technical shots let's see I think you'll be able to pull off a really advanced shot it's called a mass mass masse shot it allows the ball to make a sharp oops I suppose there isn't much point to me explaining it now. Let me give you this book. I think it'll be helpful. And we get Billiards Magician. Ooh, fancy. Um, mass shots, huh? If you're confident in your proficiency, maybe you should try it next time. Okay. See ya. 
Well, that's enough of that for tonight. And we've got another thing, only one more thing planned for this day. Java mentioned you guys are going on a school trip later this week. I'm not giving you any money, okay? And don't worry about getting me a souvenir or anything, all right? Oh, no one's gonna text us. Uh, so we're gonna head over to Central Street. Actually, we're going to head over to the Velvet Room. And it's been a while since we've done this, but we are going to hang out with the twins. Right? Yeah. What are you gonna do today? And what are we looking for? What are we looking for? A present day Tower of Babel. It looms high in the heavens, so high that the humans look down humans down below are no longer visible to the naked eye. Yeah, I think I have an idea. Tokyo Skytree. Not Tokyo Tower. Skytree and Asakusa. What'll you do? So let's head on over there. I think the last time we went to the aquarium. But we've got, there are 13 total visits, and this is number six, so we're about halfway. So, this is the present-day Tower of Babel. Incredible! It appears we've underestimated the current extent of human technology. And the metal box that took us here, my ears were so tortured by its sounds, I thought I would faint. But as a trial for reaching this place, it was mere child's play. <laughs> oh my, what could be that tiny thing in the sky? An airplane? They truly do appear to be quite cramped inside. Yeah, I can't argue with that. This is quite the view. It almost appears as if we could crush the people below us like insects. Justine. Oh, Justine, look at that. Loud as ever, what is it? How could this There's a hole in the floor. Is it some kind of trap? <laughs> Try standing on it, see what happens. Are, are you insane? It is most assuredly a trap, Caroline. Any passerby that comes too close is clearly doomed. By the way, inmate, I've heard that this Tower of Babel has a path that leads even higher than where we are now, all the way to the heavens. Really? What? Is that true? Take us there immediately. Well, it doesn't reach all the way to the heavens, but the view is still rather impressive. Yes, we can see well past the city from here, almost to the ends of the earth. However, Caroline, are you attempting to back out of this? What? What, what do you mean by that? Why would I suddenly get scared after already coming so close? Ah, I see. Then why not go even closer and enjoy the view? Are you what? C cut it out! If you want to look so badly, then go do it. <laughs> Don't mind if I do. Hey, are those kids okay? Where are their parents? Ah, they're just playing around. See? That guy's chaperoning them. Hey. Great. Now we're part of some big, humiliating misunderstanding. All because you were making such a scene, inmate. What a burden. You're the one who should feel humiliated. Ah, what a great view, though. I see how looking down from here could make a person feel like a god. Huh. Humans really des desire really knows no bounds, huh? <sighs> yes, it's no wonder their hearts go twisted, grow twisted when they're living in a city frothing with so much desire. Well, we've learned the secret of the Tower of Babel, so we'll consider this assignment complete. Here is your reward. And we get Tarukaja, Rakukaja, and Sukukaja. Those are the... Buffing skills? Yes. Yes, those are the buffing skills. I I don't know why I can never keep those, but yes. So Tarukaja is attack, Rakukaja is defense, and then Sukukaja is um, accuracy, evasion, speed, all that stuff. Hmm. Agility, I guess, <laughs> is the term used in this game. I've got like 600 hours in this series and I don't know what to call things. Uh, you better keep up with the program, inmate. Now you will accompany us for our return. I think that was a valuable use of our time, and we escorted them back to the Velvet Room.